Well, I did speak to a DNC official tonight who confirms to me there have been multiple complaints about a toxic work culture, specifically a sexist work environment. Now, the fallout of all of that, as confirmed by that DNC official tonight, is that Liz Gilbert, president of the host committee, and Adam Alonzo, chief of staff for the group, have both been placed on administrative leave pending the outcome of an internal investigation. This DNC committee official told me there have been ongoing issues and that multiple women have reported the sexist work environment, even going so far to write a letter about it. And 12 News is working to obtain that letter. That official told me that women have reported it being a quote-unquote boys club to the point where at least three staff members have left as a result. And this is all just over five months away from the convention. I do have a statement from the CEO of the DNC, Joe Salmanese, here that I'm going to read the claims made by employees of the Milwaukee 2020 Host Committee present an unacceptable and upsetting environment. The Milwaukee 2020 Host Committee Board of Directors is moving forward with a plan to restore an office culture that aligns with the values and expectations of our party. But Caroline, do we know why those two in particular were suspended? So I did ask that question uh, to that top official tonight that I spoke to. He told me uh, that he couldn't comment specifically on why those two were the ones who were um, taken out of the mix, who were sidelined. But he did tell me, quote unquote, you know, the buck stops at the top. And those are the two top officials, Joyce.